This show contains scenes of violence, coarse language, and mature subject matter. Viewer discretion is advised. Come to think about it, I think I do remember the day it all started. I woke up that morning like any other morning. It was a little cloudy. Nonetheless, it was another day at work. Now I've had my fair share of odd clients here and there, and I'm sure I could sit here and tell many good stories. But this is the story I really want to tell. Now you're probably wondering, what's a guy with an accent from Liberty City doing in Los Santos? But, I'll get to that later. First, a little more about me. The name's Tony Moretti. I'm 44 years young. Been a cab driver for 20 years. It's what I do best. It's what I know most. But don't be fooled. I know a lot more than some may think. And why is this day so special, you may ask? Well, it's the day I met Jimmy Mariani. It's the day that would change things to come. Either. Yeah. That is Jimmy Mariani. How you doing? How you doing? Hey, I'm good. So where to? Hey, Polito back. Right away. Hey, thank you. Hey, how you doing today? Yeah, I'm all right. It's a taxi driver, you know, driving a lot of people around. My ass is sore. All that kind of stuff, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I get you there, boss. I get you. Yeah. <laughs> if you don't mind me asking, though, you know, not to be a stereotypical or nothing, where are you from, then? It's funny, I was going to ask you the same thing. I'm from Broker in uh, Liberty City, of course. Yeah, me too, me too. Ah, Broker, Broker. Liberty City, ah, you know. Broker. It's a shithole, but it's our shithole. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Hey, come on, move up in the head. What the hell are you doing? Ten? Oh, Jesus Christ. Tired, this fucking guy. This fucking guy won't. Call me a little bitch to me. I'm sorry about that. Yeah. About that? Don't even worry about it. Yeah, 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 it's fine. Right, so, uh, what the hell brings a broker fella all the way here? Business of well, pleasure. Uh, a little bit of both, you know. Come down here to, uh, you know, visit some friends of mine. So, uh, yeah. you know, some business. But uh, also just to see the sights, you know. Heard there was some nice uh, clubs down here. Oh, there was some nice, you know, sightseeing, you know, go up on a, what is it, Vinewood sign or whatever. Oh, yeah, yeah, of course, of course. <laughs> I mean, the palm trees is nice, too. <laughs> Different from back home. Yeah, summertime, you know, right. you, you never need to come out wearing your fucking winter clothes, you know. You don't always wear shorts and a t-shirt. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, so, uh, you've been down here long? Me, hey, yeah. Uh, say a couple of weeks, maybe. Yeah, so Not I'm, too bad. Yeah, I'm pretty yeah, so. fresh here, I'm pretty fresh. Uh, getting to know the place still. Needed a fresh start, I guess. I don't know. Uh, you know, I wasn't yeah. involved in too much back home. I just wanted to change the scenery, really. <laughs> Got tired of, uh, yeah. tired of, you know, all the irate customers in uh, Liberty City. I mean, uh, <laughs> sometimes those people, they could be straight up chooches, eh? No, I'm guessing you are. You moved down here with your family, yeah? <laughs> nope. No, uh, I'm, uh, I'm alone. Ah, uh, I got you. Got nobody left, you know? <laughs> yeah, should I, I 
times. Yeah, you know, life goes on. Yeah, the taxi keeps going, eh? That's right. Uh, you know what? We're gonna take the nice scenic route all the way to that uh, little bay. You'll see, uh, we'll have yeah, the ocean on the side and everything with us. Jimmy and I had a nice chat on the way to Polito. I learned that he's 30 years old and he's here to meet some friends and enjoy the state. But I had a feeling he might be here for different reasons. He's pulling to this uh, auto repair shop, probably. Yeah, right here, some people. Could be a friend, right? It could be. Alright, there you go. And you know, because you're a broker boy, yeah. no charge. Oh, no, 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 I can't hey, let you throwing. do that. You gotta... I gotta do it, eh? I oh, gotta shit. do it, so... Why don't you just go me there? Wait, is that Brandon? Hey, how you doing, Tony? <laughs> Yeah, well, uh, fucking, hey, small world, eh? <laughs> hey, well, God yeah. damn. Hey, if you don't mind, I'm, uh, just stick around, stretch my legs a little bit. That was a long-ass ride right there. Hey, hey take a minute. You're me. welcome. Yeah, don't worry about it. Brandon Durano. A resourceful guy, at least from my point of view. Very useful. But yeah, though, Jimmy, what are you planning to do while you're here? I got myself a job already. What about you? Yeah, that's a load of question, eh, Mr. Durano. I don't know, maybe I'll take up taxi and, uh, like, I miss him already over here. I just don't know, you know? It's I, not I, I had to job. leave Liberty City and, uh, <laughs> I had to leave in kind of a dash. You know my situation, you know? I texted you about it. Yeah, I know. Okay, hey. you doing, Eddie? Hey, Eddie, how, hey, how you doing, doing hey, How you doing? doing? Hey, Miss Moretti, how you doing? I'm good, I can't complain, I, <laughs> I got me a little tap, but hell. Eddie Sorella, the type of guy to get into a lot of trouble, but is nice as a nun, unless you get on his bad side. I can't really see it that well. Oh, it's, uh, it's supposed to be uh, the Virgin Mary. Uh, religious man, I got you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's the pothead tattoo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I'm really into these. I don't know why. Tell a story, you know. Did you ever got uh, any tattoos in Mr. Moretti? Uh, no. No, I uh, have not. I'm uh, not a fan of the needle. Believe it or not. Yeah. I know I look tough as shit, but <laughs> needles are just not my thing. Yeah, uh, I was telling him on the way over here, Mr. Toronto. I said, uh, you know, he's got to step out of his comfort zone, get out of the taxi, you know. I told him we were going to hike that hill one time, you know? <laughs> oh, I definitely. Said, I was talking about that with Eddie. That fucking hill. <laughs> yeah, it's one hell of just a Just coincidentally. Hill. You never want to look back on it and be like, God damn, I wish I would have done it. You just want to be like, God damn, I'm glad I did it. Yeah, yeah but it, if it, I was in your kind of shape, then maybe I'd think that way too. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it'll be fun, but we'll do it one of these days. So, are you guys, you living down here in Toronto, or what's what's going on here? Oh, you say you don't have a house. What about you there? No. You got a house, Mr. Teddy? Oh, no, I've been trying to shack up with the, uh... The dancers, but fuck, I haven't been able to take one home. Goddamn, don't bring me home. To uh, live around here. Yeah. I'm still hitting hotels. We're here for uh, we're here for uh, um, business. That's why we're here, me and Eddie. Yeah, understandable. That's why we couldn't get you from the airport. Yeah, I met Mr. Moretti, so I guess it's a plus one, you know. Yeah, it's the, true. Uh, that's true. First new local friend. Oh, that's nice. Thank you. <laughs> I'm sure you boys want to, you know, catch up and all that. I got some business I got to do, but hopefully I uh, bump into you again. Eh? Maybe at that bar, titty bar, or something like that. Eh? Uh, that's where I hang out. Yeah. yeah, we'll see you soon. I know I'll be there. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, welcome to... Yeah, uh, I got your number, so... Yeah, welcome to San Andreas, Jimmy. I'm sure Eddie yeah, and uh, sure. Toronto here are going to take good care of you. I'll see you around, of eh? Of course. <laughs> yeah, you too, there, Mr. Moretti. I need a driver for a pickup right away. Yeah, no problem. Send the details and I'll be there racing. I could tell you right now. This was not going to be the last time I see these guys. When I arrived, I noticed a couple of familiar faces. Leah Abbott, Ryan Youngblood, and of course, Jimmy. But more importantly, it's the day I met Kyle Williams. It's Tony. Uh, who is that? Tony, hey. the cab driver. Hey, been a while, eh, Jimmy? So, <laughs> how's your shitty treating you, eh? 
Yeah, it's been pretty good, not gonna lie to you. It's been pretty good. I just took a cab right then. <laughs> hey, oh, really? Yeah, yeah. Mr. Um, Mr. Um, Mr. Toronto gave me uh, some money, you know, gave me some stuff to go uh, about my day. But Tony here knows Mr. Tur um, Mr. Toronto, too. And Eddie. Mm -hmm. yeah, I, I, know, I, I do. I know. I do. Be right back. You know, Mr. Moretti, do you know my friend here to my left? You met him? I don't believe we have met. What do I have the right, pleasure? Let me introduce you to him. Hey, this is uh, Kyle Williams. You know, he's like a brother to me. Kyle hey, Williams. How you doing, Tony? Yeah, I'm good. Yeah, I'm Kyle. It's nice to meet you. Yeah, likewise. How did you get any more rights today? I just did my last client, uh, I don't know, maybe uh, 15 minutes or so ago. I just came to my usual spot. Good people around here. Of course. I mean, with people like these, you know, there's nothing but good. Oh, thanks, Jimmy. That's nice. Of course. <laughs> I also remember coming to the city and not knowing very much of anything or anyone. Of course, yeah, but you know, when I was here alone, you know, you, uh, you showed me a good time. Now that I got a ton of friends here, you know, we'll show you two a good time. And if I you mean, just get I too drunk or something, uh, like fucked up on them pills and whatever you kids take now to fucking have fun, well, uh, you know, that's where I come in. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll exactly. give him a exactly. call, you know? We'll give him a call. <laughs> A little later, I could overhear Jimmy and Ryan talking about business. Up to you, Mr. Youngblood. I mean, I can show you one today and then take it to my buddy tomorrow or something. Yeah, well, uh, I mean, we, we could take a drive down. I mean, what the fuck else have we got to do? Yeah, yeah. What are you uh, boys looking you. into? A little bit of uh, Christmas, you know what I'm talking about? Buy some fake snow for my Christmas decorations, you know? I've had my run-in with Christmas quite a few times. Yeah, uh, you went to that shit? No, not... Yeah, I mean, not really uh, the whole other aspect of it, but uh, the consuming part is you know, something I'm very fond of once in a while. I know how to party, you know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, the sedentary life of the taxi driver. I, I, you know, I, I just imagine you before that, you were fucking down with a party animal or something, eh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, well, uh, I mean, I think we're done here. So, I mean, if you if you want to, you could you could join us. But uh, you know, if you have calls to take, it's up to you. Yeah, I mean, you know me. Could use more people. Yeah, maybe, maybe, maybe some other time. I, I don't know. I, I don't know if I want to slide into that I'm stuff. Fine. You know, I, I'm just trying to keep myself clean around here, and you know. But if you have a few lines to spare later, I don't know. <laughs> of course, yeah, no problem. Don't worry about it. You know, I'll, uh, I'll, you know, I'll call you if I need anything, you know, any uh, taxis, anything like that. You enjoy your day, Mr. Moretti, yeah? I'm there I'll for see you. you soon. Yeah. I'm there for you. Pleasure meeting you, Mr. Moretti. Yes, you too, uh... You wanna just, Kyle. uh... You wanna just, uh, follow us, Jimmy? Sure. Lock the door, you bum! <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I couldn't help myself. <laughs> hey, y'all, take that, care, eh? Uh, <laughs> Jimmy to Bye, Tony. Hey, yeah, take care, Leah. Ryan. Yo, Eddie. Dude, we thought that we thought they busted you back over at the fucking brewery. Like, <laughs> and then all of a sudden, oh, yeah. you're taking off. Yeah, I was playing it cool. I didn't leave until uh, if I would have known that was you guys in the car, I would have. Uh, I would have got out and said hello. I mean, we were calling to you, but I think you had your radio on a bit too late. Ah, shit. Okay. It's alright though. Don't worry. Friends of yours, uh, Eddie? Yeah, yeah. I'm, uh, see, I'm uh, Calvin. Ka yeah, Calvin. Katarina. Nice to meet you, too. I'm Tony. Nice to meet you, Tony. I'm gonna grab the rest of the stuff out of my car. You won't believe the first conversation I had with Katarina and Calvin. Mr. Tony, let me ask you a question. When you go to clean out your, your taxi and all, do you ever find anything fucking, like, weird, like, cleaning it out and shit? Yeah, you have no idea. <laughs> 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 I could imagine, man. You know, I kid you not, but once, uh, once I, uh, uh, not very proud of this, but I uh, had to pick up some actual human shit, like a fucking oh turd. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh uh, jeez. Had a bunch of frat boys back in Liberty City, I remember, and one of them fucking shit in my cab. I didn't know until you know, until I had to clean out the cab for the day. Back in England, if you uh, threw up in the back of a taxi, you were in a lot of trouble. Oh yeah, trust me, I made them fucking clean up if they did that. I'm not doing that. I ain't picking up no vomit, I swear to God. Uh, vomit you would expect, but actual... <laughs> just shit in the back. Shit is worse than... Yeah. Well, we still want to go get a coffee and some breakfast, don't we? Uh, yeah, I kind of want to shower and get out of these clothes, too, so... Yeah. Let's, uh... 
Let's go get. Let's go sort ourselves out. We'll see you guys in a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. yeah you guys be careful. I'm gonna chill right here and uh, hopefully stay out of trouble. You uh, <laughs> you guys get cleaned up and shit. Hopefully we'll see you. It was nice meeting you. Yeah. Likewise. Um, likewise. Do you want to walk to the shop around the corner, or, do, or are we going to just drive? Uh, I can just walk, stretch my legs. I've been in the car all morning. I remember thinking that you looked so damn familiar. Next morning, I got a call minutes before checking in for the day. It was Jimmy. He asked if I could come to Polito Bay for a ride, but to come off the meter. In other words, call in sick, because this might take a while. I was curious, so I said yeah, plus he would still pay me. You go talk to Tony. Hey, Mr. Williams, do? calm the fuck down, eh? Calm the fuck down. Yeah, I don't do this shit, Jimmy. You don't want to fucking look at it, then. Don't fucking look at it, alright? Fuck. No, what's going hey, on here? Mr. Moretti, how the fuck you doing? How it's the just fuck business. Uh, Jesus Christ, man. We've got to deal with some business back here, and uh, we need a ride, you know. And I thought that you would be a very capable person to uh, give us that ride after our business is done. Yeah, yeah, sure. What business exactly? Yeah. Oh, yeah, I see that now. It's uh, the type of business that we don't ask questions about, eh? All right. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. All right. Do you all think right. you'll be okay with that, Mr. Moretti? I, I hope I can trust you to uh, safely transport us when the business is done. Yeah. <clears throat> sure. Yeah, I don't ask questions. I, I just... I'm a taxi driver. I don't care about your affairs. That's why I knew to call you there, Tony. That's why I knew to call you. Take your famous, buddy. <laughs>